Hey guys, Sam here. Uh, today's Sunday, um, December 20 something. Anyways, I've got the Power Glide back fully assembled. Uh, the tail extension part is just, um, it's not bolted all the way on there, it's just, it's just uh, mounted on there so I can get it painted. So I've got it back on the engine stand. And that's what I'm going to do today is go ahead and um, give it a paint job. So I got the pan back at the bottom and torqued down and everything taped off or I'm going to go ahead and spray it. I said I wasn't going to well, I said I was going to use just uh, some rattle can or spray bomb, but I went ahead and bought some some paint from Eastwood, so I'll show you guys as I uh, get ready to mix it up. And kind of sanded it a little bit, scuffed it, didn't really uh, mess with it too much. Got some uh, paint thinner um, and sprayed it with a spray bottle with some paint thinner um, to clean the any grease or anything off of it um, so wiped it down with a rag and then also wiped it down with the wax and grease remover and so I'm just going to kind of clean up a little bit around here pick up some stuff and then go ahead and mix up some paint and get it painted uh, today is uh, let's see we've got yesterday would have been a really good day to paint it I think our high was around uh, right up at 68 or 70 Today is not going to be quite as high on the temperature. It's only going to be about 55. Uh, but I think I can get it warm enough in here. Um, I can usually get it up to about 75 in here with that small heater I got going. So it should be warm enough to go ahead and paint it and then dry overnight. And uh, We're not getting any free freezing temperatures overnight. I mean, we're probably getting the 30s, but... 35 or so but it's warming up in the 60s next couple of days so let me get uh, cleaned up and get started on painting uh, get started on mixing up mixing up some paint all right bring you guys back in a bit all right guys I'm getting ready to paint the transmission um, I'm gonna go ahead and just I don't th I don't know if it's necessary or not but I'm going to hit it with some uh, VHT self edge primer to hopefully help that paint stick um, since I didn't really sand it. Tried to sand it the best I could, um, but you got so many little spots that can't get into. But, anyways, I'm going to try this.
All right, guys. There you go. The power glide is painted. It. I'm not sure if I like the color, but that's gonna have to do. It. It. Um. It's that Eastwood high temp ceramic engine paint, and it's the universal aluminum. Um. Kind of thinking now I should have gone black, but uh, I, it turned out okay. It looks like a gray primer to me, but but it's got a good shine to it and so that's going to have to do because I'm not going to paint it over again. <clears throat> really need, really didn't need to paint inside there but I went ahead and just gave it a quick coat inside that area and turned out pretty good. As far as the dip tube I think I'm just going to leave it um, stainless steel or that right there I just don't I may shine it up a little bit with uh, some emery cloth or steel wool or something or I may just paint it like that aluminum but I guess I should have done it because I had a little bit of paint left over alright guys I'm calling it quits for today so that pretty much completes the power glide and I was I did uh, I forgot to mention I did replace that um, seal there and also the bushing that goes inside there that last bushing that was left over that's where it went because everybody that made a comment was right that it went in there so got that done and I just need to let it dry up and then I'm gonna got a few few more thing few more things to do to the engine and then I'll hook up the transmission to the engine and see about getting it in the car because I've been trying to figure out if I'm gonna what I'm gonna do for a radiator if I'm gonna have to go with a notch on the side of the radiator because of the uh, gearbox for the power steering that I put in and I kinda been messing around with it over here I got it covered up right now but I'll show you guys on the next vid alright thanks for watching thanks for subscribing and um, we'll see what we got going on for the next video See you guys later. Have a Merry Christmas. Happy New Year if I don't get to talk to you before then.